You first disconnect the two weather pack electrical ends on the motor and the PWM valve. Take the pin out of the agitator sprocket and remove sprocket. Take the pin and spacer off the hydraulic motor. Using a 15 16 wrench, loosen the two flange nuts that hold the roller and the PWM bracket onto the meter. Once the nuts are removed, the motor can slide off of the roller shaft and the PWM bracket can also be removed. The roller may now be removed from the meter. When you decide on which roller to use, you may now insert the roller back into the meter. You may need to take the front inspection door off of the meter to help guide the roller into the other bearing on the meter. Replace the PWM bracket along with the motor. Once the flange nuts are finger tight, use the 15 16 wrench to tighten the nuts enough to ensure the rubber gasket is flush with the outside of the meter and not to torque too much and push the gasket into the meter. This would create restriction. Replace the spacer and the pin that holds the motor to the PWM bracket. Replace the agitator shaft sprocket and insert the pin that holds it on. This procedure is complete.